you are dead. You weren't sure what the next step was, but you open your eyes and there you are again. Alive? No, but not truly dead either. An unknown world, a new objective, some new people. D-Exit explores the plane of memory, a world where those who strive for good in life come to live as long as they are remembered. There, all kinds of cultures exist. Death is no longer seen as an end, but as a conversation and a new step on our path. A survivor is a hero. This world that was meant to be your safe haven to rest and think is clearly not what you expected. It is being corrupted, torn apart from the inside, and the inhabitants of the plane of memory have lost all hope. Only you are brave enough to help to bring back the light that will get rid of the corruption. But to do so, you will not need to fight. Surviving and reaching your objectives is hard enough. There is no combat in D-Exit. It's about sneaking from corrupted enemies, solving intricate puzzles, finding the best path to take among the rubble of this broken world fleeing from great beasts, and in the end, saving the world. A voxel cinematographic experience with complex and movie-like camera movements, grandiose lighting and VFX, and all contrasting with a minimalistic voxel aesthetic. This idea of contrast is central in the game and makes it truly stand out. The simplicity is able to cause both surprise in the player and helps focus and highlight even more cinematic aspects. Epic, but intimate. Talking about contrast, the main story is of great proportions, an adventure about saving a world at the brink of destruction, with great powers and even greater foes. But in its core, D-Exit is about the people. Not so much about death itself, but about how we perceive it one way or another. The sadness and grief it brings, but also the acceptance some have towards it. It's about helping others and accepting help, about a world that lost not only themselves, but friends they made and how you spark in the dark to bring back this joy to them. D-Exit is, in the end, another perspective on death and heroism, where death is a step on our path, one of survival in the face of illness, another viable form of heroism.